Let's make one thing clear right away. Buddy is the star of the show here. The 10-year-old German short hair pointer is the power behind this skajoring duo. This winter will be my eighth year skajoring with him. Tyler McCain had never tried skajoring when he got Buddy, but today they are the reigning Midwest Series champions, have won two national championships, and competed in the world championships. So what is skajoring, you might ask? Think cross-country skiing meets dog sledding. You're tethered uh, between the skier and the dog, and you ski down the trail together. Sounds simple, right? Well, Tyler, let me give it a go with Buddy. Oh my God. Okay. Woo. And all was going pretty well until this. Oh my God. Oh my God. What happened? One fall. It was all my fault. Buddy's doing great. We dusted that off and kept rolling along. Big thanks to Buddy for being patient with me. So can any dog do this? Not every dog wants to skajor. Yeah. Not every dog can skajor, but the vast majority of them can. Tyler says you just want to gradually ease them into it. You may not be winning any championships like Buddy and Tyler, but a great way to get out and connect with nature and your four-legged friend. In Medina, Brian Pyatt, Carol Evan News. Good job, buddy. Woo. So Tyler says a great resource to find trails that you are able to skajor on is caninepower.org. Yeah. It looks like a lot of fun and a big thanks to the Three Rivers Park District for letting us use their trails at the Baker Winter Trailhead, something I wouldn't mind getting out trying again. I did it a number of years ago. It's pretty yeah. fun. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, I got to find a bigger dog, I guess. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> now for your winter wonder keyword, snowboard. It is snowboard. Head on over to carolum.com slash winter wonder to enter that keyword. You'll be registered to win a prize pack from the Minnesota Lottery to help you along the way during your own winter wonder journey. Let's 